Next we will discuss EVNG networks. I am talking network means the clouds. If I go back and let me close this one. So right click here nodes means the node which you install it will be in blue. And the one which is gray out is not installed those nodes. So we install few switches and we install router as well. It should be blue yeah this one. So Cisco IOL and these are in blue color. But after this when you go to after the node there is a network. So when you click on the network so you will see these cloud. This is called network or clouds. There are many cloud from bridge to cloud nine. What is the purpose of these cloud? This is our topic. The first one is bridge. Bridge basically means a dummy switch. Dummy, dummy switch or hub. Consider them as a dummy switch and hub. Here they call them bridge. Don't confuse with this one. The first cloud and click save. It will open this one. You see it's a Leica and you can connect as many device you want. Just for connectivity you can use them. So I connect this one and I connect this one and I connect this one and as many you want. You can connect these devices just to connect them like a hub or connect them to the switch. That's it. And when you assign IP you can ping, uh, ping from here to here. So if I go here let me quickly start this one and start this one. So until it's come up let's see we discuss uh, other clouds. Okay, so it means this bridge. Okay, I give them dummy switch. Okay, and these are the two router I connect them. So let me say no. Okay, and if this one is come up, so let me say no. Just to assign IP to show you that how you can use this in your lab. It's like a hub. If you just need a connectivity, no need to configure VLAN or nothing and you don't need to go inside so let's go to enable config interface fast ethernet 0 slash 0 ip address 1.1.1 255.0.0 no shutdown and let's go to this one uh, sorry let me go to another one 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 i assigned there here i will assign interface fast ethernet 0 slash 0 ip address 1.1.2 255.0.0 no shutdown and let's ping from here to one so hopefully i will ping here and let me show you as well debug ip icmp and let me start to ping 1.1.1 and i hope so it's gonna ping yeah so you can see i'm receiving the ping so it means this bridge provide me uh, a, a like a switch connectivity or a hub you can say but I cannot go inside if I click it's not going to click you get a, they get the idea this is the first network we call them a bridge unmanaged switch or hub and how you can add right click and add object and this is the first one object uh, sorry bridge and then you can connect the devices how many devices you want to connect they just connect them and use them clear now what the hell the other one right click here go to network okay bridge is clear to us what about management from cloud zero they call them management as well cloud zero to nine so these you can map them and you can use them internally as well for two purpose these clouds are there let me go to our eveng so this is our eveng and let me go to setting so yesterday if you remember I put the first interface net, second host only, third bridge and let me bring this one as well side by side. So here is. So basically bridge we know this is a switch a dummy switch. The things are start from here. Management cloud zero means the first interface here which is net. Cloud one means the second interface here host only. And cloud 2 means the third interface because the first one will go as a like a dummy uh, switch or hub. So forget about that one. You are starting from zero. So cloud zero means the first interface. Cloud one means the second interface. Cloud two means the third interface. In this case we have three interfaces. So it means we can map these three interfaces to the outside world as well. 
so in this way we will access inside devices easily you get the idea what i'm saying i will explain you let me find out the ranges first so that i can prove you what is the net so the first one is net yeah let's go to keep in mind let me type here the first one is net second is host only and third is bridge again as a bridge bridge is many concepts so don't confuse yourself here so the first one is net two and three let's find out the ranges of this one so let's go to virtual network editor and let me type change setting so that can show the bridge as well okay so the net range is 236 so net we know this 236 so 192 168 236.0 slash 24 okay and the 192 168 let's check out the host only host only is 127 127.0 slash 24 and bridge so bridge you need to find out where you have bridge this one so this is auto bridge so auto bridge whatever is connected right now i am connected through cable so it will automatically map to this cable so let's see what is the range of my cable so i am connected through cable and the range is 100 so let me type this one here 192 100.0 slash 24 so i have three interfaces connected to my uh, by the way you can find these ranges is here as well vmnet 8236 host only is this one so this is 127 and the third one i bridge them is 100 so it's up to you you can find from there and also you can find from here so now you get the three interfaces yeah if you are using one interface then you can use one now net host only and bridge that's why i add three interfaces so you have a lot of chances to go inside to eve to connect them from your machine so i know the ranges let's prove them that yes these things are mapped okay that the management is mapped to the first one so first one is net cloud one is mapped to the second one which is host only and cloud 2 is mapped to the third one which is bridge okay so let's test them let me put this one here and let me uh, take uh, three network are cloud so let's go to the management and let me type here management either cloud zero so that i know this is cloud zero so i take cloud zero right click go to network and go to cloud one so let me type here so this is cloud one okay so this is cloud one and let's go to network and go to cloud two and let's type because i have only uh, three interfaces outside so i can only use these three outside so okay i give them the same okay and now i need three devices so let's go to let's take the routers it's better to take routers you can take vpc as well so i need three routers okay and let me save and let me put this router here the first one this is the second one and this is the third one okay let me connect this one okay and let's start this one and let's connect this one to cloud one okay and let's connect this one to cloud 3 so let me start this one as well and let's start this one as well until it's come up let me tell you that the first range has to be this one cloud 0 will map the first one yeah so if i right click and text so let me copy here i'm sure that this router will get this range and right click let's go to text and the second will get this range okay let me put this one here and i'm dead sure that the third one will get the 100 range which is bridge copy and paste and let's go to here so these are the range it's my expectation Per my understanding that these cloud will provide these ranges automatically because these are mapped to the outside range here. 
is mapped to the first second and third so the first one is here this one demi switch so i start from cloud 0 1 and 2 let's see so let's go to r4 and let me type no okay and i will say get the ip because all three are dhcp as well so let's see it will get 236 or not so let me go to this router enable configuration interface was ethernet 0 slash 0 ip address dhcp and no shutdown and let me see show ip interface brief after a while it has to get 236 range so let's see 236 range has to take them yeah so you can see 192 168 236 range 130 ips take this one because cloud zero is mapped to the first one so this one is correct now let's go to this one as per my understanding this one has to get 127 because this cloud has mapped to the second one so here is cloud one but on the range is the second one okay so let's see this one so i open this router enable interface fast ethernet 0 slash 0 ip address dhcp no shutdown why i'm telling you all this because i face this issue for a year and year students are sending me the request this issue this issue how i can find my range how what is my cloud range so that's why i am doing for you as well so yeah let's get the ip and let's see show ip interface brief and here is 127 range so this one is done now let's go to the third one and type no and it will get my interface which is the real interface where i'm connected so it's bridge so definitely it will take that one so enable configure interface fast ethernet 0 slash 0 ip address dhcp no shutdown okay and let's see which range it will take definitely it has to take the 100 range so let's see okay and let's see it's going to take 100 yeah so it's take 100.29 so this one is proved now the second thing is you will say what the hell i should do if i know the range what i can do with this one with the help of these three cloud which we add them here that's why i add three interfaces you can use net net provide you internet as well host provide you no no internet and bridge provide you internet if you have an internet so it means if you need internet so this the first one there is internet if i try to ping yahoo.com so it has to be reachable okay it has to work so let's see yeah so it's pinging it means this there is internet yes this is the only one host who will not provide you internet and this third one will also provide you internet let's ping 888 yes it has to ping yeah the only one which is this one so this is the beauty it means you have two link to provide you internet so if in your topology you need internet so you can use cloud zero and you can use your bridge one which is cloud two this one is clear what is the second advantage okay you will say okay if there is no internet why the hell we are using the second one you can use them for management to access this device from your outside how like go to config ip http authentication local username admin privilege 15 password 123 and what else i need username is there ip http server to enable http server ip http secure server as well secure server as well so let me access this device in my so what is the ip show ip interface brief yeah 129 because these three interfaces are installed in my system it's here this one this one this one it means if i connect this to my cloud through cloud to these devices so i can reach to this device from my browser let me type this one and enter yes admin and one two three yes and i access this device from my browser 
so they can provide you to reach to these devices inside it can be firewall it can be uh, whatever 40 manager it can be router it can be switches if you want to access them from your system so you can use these three cloud the beauty is that the first cloud will provide you internet as well the third one will provide you internet as well and all three will provide you to access these devices from your system okay so this point is clear right click go to bridge so bridge is clear management through cloud 2 is clear then what the hell is cloud 3 to 9 let's take cloud 3 cloud 3 what i will do with this one should i can i use this one to access from outside no but you can use them locally let me stop this one because i, I don't want to get other devices just use them inside and connect them so if you need internal connectivity the only thing is from cloud 3 to 9 unfortunately you cannot access these devices with the help of this cloud from outside like this one which one from here from cloud 3 to 9 you can use inside your lab as a switch as a hub as a connectivity whatever you like it's up to you but the first three in my case if you are using one interface here then only you can utilize only the first cloud that's why i told you that time i add two interfaces when i was installing even though you can add later on as well so that you have more window open so that you can access your evng i hope so you get the idea this was just the cloud so management cloud it will go the first one to this one second one to this one and similarly in this case i put only two so i can utilize the first two only bridge is excluded which is like a bridge switch and from cloud two to nine i can use them inside so i hope so uh, you understand this uh, cloud so um, when i do the lab so in my cloud range will be different your cloud you know when i was doing so this is the range 65 114 and when i done here so the range is different so please don't tell me when you do your lab i will use my range you need to use your range and you can find the range never message me that i don't know what is my ip to put them i show you as well and through detail okay that's it